Hi, Assalamualaikum and a very good day. Today, I would like to present about challenges in group presentation for MGT 400 Introduction to Management. Our team members, I'm Ismail Yaqub, uh, Mr. Zame Haji Zainal, Zaida Abu Amin, and the uh, last one is uh, Arif Awas. Okay, the table of content for today is background, challenge, planning, organizing, leading, controlling, conclusion, and the last one is uh, recommendation. Okay, for background. Okay, why our group is choose for McDonald? Because McDonald is the, what we know is the, the biggest company in the world. Okay, the McDonald's is a fast food restaurant in the United States of America, USA, which uh, is, is, a, is established in uh, 1914 um, by Richard and Morris McDonald in San Borneo, California. Okay, in American, uh, is businessman joined the company as a franchise agent and acquire, acquiring for the fast food chain uh, franchise later in 1961. Currently, McDonald's have a served customer over 1,000 countries within 4, 1,400 outlets throughout the, the world. Okay, uh, we look the in December, 1918, McDonald Corporation USA uh, gave the Golden Arch Restaurant Cinderella Hut license to pay their in position the brands of McDonald Restaurant in Malaysia. The first uh, outlet in established in Jalan Bukit Bintang, uh, uh, if you know, in Kuala Lumpur on 28 April 1982. Uh, later in December 2016, McDonald Corporation have transferred to ownership McDonald's Malaysia to a Saudi Arabia company, La Lion PTA Ltd. under the franchise system called Development License, which allow them to control the operation, the outlet in Malaysia and Singapore, uh, respectively. Okay, now we move to the challenge of face and effecting on planning, organization, leading and controlling uh, face by McDonald's. Uh, what we see, okay, due to the highest infection in rate virus in country, COVID-19, uh, what we call COVID-19 on 2019 and started in Wuhan, China, the most country around the world faced difficulty economy and affected various industry uh, severely. Uh, FMB industry, for example, striking to comprehend with the change of business nature as a result of the pandemic recent in 2019. Uh, in addition, uh, the recent spike of inflation rate, especially in Malaysia, seem adding up to issues faced by most of business the countries, which is uh, this content. FMB industry, McDonald's, Malaysia face no exception, no this matter. And um, they need to overcome uh, several difficult to keep the business standing and important satisfying and needs of the customers. All right, uh, for this slide, uh, I will present about how the uh, company McDonald uh, planning during the uh, temporary close uh, during MCO, right? Uh, as we know, uh, our country have been uh, attacked by COVID-19 uh, and MCO. So, uh, the McDonald company, the McDonald restaurant need to close the, uh, during pandemic. So the customer cannot dine in in the restaurant uh, and uh, feel good moment that their mission statement cannot be applied to the customer because uh, how they how they want to commit the, the mission statement because uh, the customer 
cannot came to their their restaurant all right second thing uh they need to do a safety measure for the customer during the uh, mco uh, because uh, our country turn uh, the statement uh, from pandemic to endemic so uh, government uh, apply uh, customer can then dine into the restaurant but uh the restaurant need to do a cure uh, action during the endemic first they need to uh, make sure the restaurant safety and clean uh, then the when the customer dine in uh, in the restaurant uh, the staff in the restaurant need to ensure that uh, the customer is fully held. Uh, other than that, the restaurant, the McDonald company, structured uh, their standing plan. Uh, for example, uh, in the restaurant, they have buy thermometers, hand sanitizer, uh, masks uh, in the premises. Uh, for the staff actually and for the for the customer so uh, the cost uh, the cost become increased due to new government regulation all right for this slide uh, i will tell you about the organizing how the mcdonald company organizing uh, their company due to mco okay uh, in during uh, MCO uh, COVID-19 uh, they have changed in business activity and increase in wages okay uh, another impact of COVID-19 is the operation hours has been changed due to SOP and guideline uh, restricted other than that the operation hours were rescheduled Customer allowed to enter the premises at the time during uh, MCO were also limited. Uh, imposed job uh, simplification, which defined the reducing numbers of tasks for workers due to limited working hours. Uh, other than that, unstable economic growth in Malaysia, uh, and unfortunately, uh, at the same time. Uh, the government uh, implement the minimum wages uh, for the citizen around RM1500 per month. Okay. For the leading point, uh, during this MCO, the company will have to do such uh, st step or ways to uh, make change in employee workload and welfare. First, in order to face this MCO challenge, employees uh, was being given choices to work from home or work at the office with short period of time to prevent any mass gathering happen at the workplace during this COVID-19 period. However, it is different uh, for workers in the F&B industries as they must perform the operational tasks at the workplace, including fast food uh, restaurant. Then, uh, McDonald was uh, rescheduling the operation shift uh, roster as the operational hours were different. And then, uh, they, uh, the number of workers allowed to be at the premise was reduced to the uh, minimum uh, follow the guideline by the government and and then workers were assigned with extra workload as they need to ensure the safety and cleanliness of their workplace for controlling uh, McDonald was facing in food inventory and supply chain problem so 
during this COVID-19, all restaurants face the same problem uh, during those times as the stock of goods and foods became stale. Uh, and then McDonald's facing inventory problems as the freshness and taste of taste of food uh, were affected as they were kept in inventory for a long period. And then the cost of expenses for McDonald's was impacted by the depreciation of the Malaysian ringgit and the erratic economic expansion of the nation. They have to deal with foreign market when importing some products such as uh, cheese and potatoes. Therefore, any change in currency had an effect on the product's actual cost. Now we move to the conclusion and also recommendation. So I will explain to you six conclusion and also recommendation for McDonald's. So first thing first is increase the food and safety measures because food safety always been a major concern by the government and the FMB industry since the breakout of COVID-19 as it might affect customer health and well-being. So McDonald's imposed a few obligations to the workers and also to the customers such as requiring them to wear masks and check on their body temperature before entering the premise to make sure none of virus can be spread during any transaction. Both parties also need to sanitize their hands with provided sanitizer at the counter. Other than that, they can also serve customers right to their own transport for takeaway services to minimize contact and interaction. The second one is by upgrading the drive through system. So McDonald's have to took the initiative to increase the number of staff working on drive through checkpoints. This is to accommodate customers well. During CMCO, which numbers of customers allowed to dine in were limited. This drive through checkpoints make things easier for both parties. So customers can still enjoy their food without entering their premises to dine in of takeaway. So next is positioning staff or workers. McDonald's have took the initiative through job design to position specified staff particularly to ensure the matter being took care of which is the staff will also need to sanitize all the tables after being used, sanitize the floor, replacing the sanitizer at the counters and also at, at the doors, and also need to monitoring the social distance inside the premises. So the recommendation will, uh, the, the workers will get uh, extra allowance for this kind of job design. Next one is self-service cleanup system. McDonald's also suggests the self-service system towards customer for dining services, which is they have to fill up the paper bag given with the excess of meals, empty container used for food, and also tissues before putting inside the bin prepared at the corner of premises. Increasing the number of food delivery and job opportunities which is most of restaurants using delivery system to ensure their sales. McDonald's, on the other hand, already offered the service before the COVID-19. However, due to the ban of dine in activities, the number of orders were increased, increased daily, daily. So McDonald's sets partnership with Food Panda and also GrabFood to double up the number of their riders to ensure customers receive their foods on time in safety. Incorporating technology, which is order of food, can be easily made from the application of McDonald's. As the mission and effort to secure the safety of customers and minimizing the contacts, this application provides accessible experience for customers to enjoy their food by delivering to them. As for suggestion, McDonald's could simplify the process of ordering from their own application by breaking down the location of ordering according to the area of outlet device. This is to ensure the, the orders get faster than their expectations.